من الطاهرين وصحابته الغر الميامين وعنا معهم برحمتك يا أرحم الراحمين رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي أمري وحل العقدة من لساني يفقه قولي اللهم اغفر لنا اللهم ارحمنا اللهم يسر ولا تعسر There is a sister who is still in سكرات الموت We ask Allah سبحانه وتعالى to ease سكرات الموت on her and make her departure to the next world easy May Allah give sabr to her family اللهم هون عليها في سكرات الموت اللهم هون عليها في سكرات الموت اللهم هون عليها في سكرات الموت يا أرحم الراحمين يا رب العالمين آمين Respected sisters, brothers We continue with سورة الدخان سورة 44 verse 59 As written there جزام الله خير The brother who wrote that Uh Sorry, we continue with Al-Jathiyah, with Al-Jathiyah, we read one page, and then we co- come back to Tafsir verse 33. Al-Jathiyah, the next surah, 45, because we did finish the recitation. Yeah. Are you all next surah, 45, Al-Jathiyah? Let's recite together, inshallah. May Allah give us the barakah of this Quran which is being recited in this house of Allah. Al Jathiyah, Surah 45. A'udhu billahi min ash shaytan ir rajeem. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Amin. Tanzeel al kitab min Allah al Aziz al Hakim. In the Samawati wal Arodila ayat lil Mu'minin. وفي خلقكم وما يبث من دابة No, no You have, try to follow me exactly as I do من دابة Very good. You know what makes, what's the reason for elongation? Elongation, why we have alif, long, like da, abba. Two things, remember them. If it's followed by hamza, example, idha ja'a, the alphabet that is elongated is followed by hamza, like idha ja'a. Or subdue, like here. Dab. If there is subdue after the elongation, we make it long. If also Hamza is coming. Clear? Example like this. Two things make us elongate the alif. If followed by Hamza, like Ida ja. So this is the reason. The Hamza makes this one go six seconds. Okay? Or this, why we elongate it? Because of Sabdu. There is a Sabdu coming. Here, Dabba. So if there is Shadda, this Alif has to go six seconds. If Hamza also. Clear? Who can read for us Inna Anzalnahu? Why? Because Hamza. There is Hamza. 
inna an oh the alif the alif is coming that's why okay same thing if hamza is coming if sabdu is coming clear inshallah i hope this is, this rule is now inside but lock it don't let it come out idha ja ah no idha ja Dabba, no. Dabba. Huh. So speaking Arabic is not like reading the Quran. Totally different. MashaAllah. And that's what makes the words of Allah more beautiful. The way we read Tajweed. We must learn how to recite the Quran. Allah will ask us, Yom Al-Qiyamah, by the way, why you didn't try? There was class, you were reciting one page at least before tafsir, why you didn't even? By the way, I, very few people approach me and say, Sheikh, how to read this? Outside, outside class. Even in class you don't ask, let alone outside. Takbir. Very few people sit with you and say, Sheikh, can you please? Very few. Don't be shy. When Allah brings someone who is a little bit learned than you, it's for you to ask. Because Yom Al-Qiyam say, I brought him to you. But you were just running as if I don't know what. Up to you. I am in front of you. After, the, after class, I sit there. Taib. <coughs> Good. وَفِي خَلْقِكُمْ وَمَا يَبُثُّ مِنْ دَابَّةٍ آيَاتٌ لِقَوْمٍ يُوقِنُونَ Okay, not bad at all, but we can do better. وَفِي خَلْقِكُمْ وَمَا يَبُثُّ مِنْ دَابَّةٍ آيَاتٌ لِقَوْمٍ يُوقِنُونَ Excellent, very good, much better. وَاخْتِلَافِ اللَّيْلِ وَالنَّهَارِ وَمَا أَنزَلَ اللَّهُ مِنَ السَّمَاءِ مِنْ رِزْقًا مِنْ رِزْقٍ فَأَحْيَا بِهِ الْأَرْضَ بَعْدَ مَوْتِهَا وَتَصْرِيفِ الْرِّيَاحِ آيَاتٌ لِقَوْمٍ يَعْقِلُونَ تلك آيات الله نتلوها عليك بالحق بالحق ها فبأي حديث بعد الله وآياته يؤمنون ويل لكل أفاك أثيم يسمع آيات الله تتلى عليه ثم يصر مستكبرا ثم 
ثم يصر مستكبرا كأن لم يسمعها فبشره بعذاب أليم وإذا علم من آياتنا شيئا اتخذها هزوا Pay attention there. Shay'an. Shay'an. Ittakhadha. Becomes shay'ani. Very good. Very good. Ah, sisters much better because they attend more classes. Simple as this. Ha. Huh. This. Shay'an. Right? Tanween. Right? Then followed by. This is silent. And this is silent. The first silent becomes kasra. Shay'ani. See? Shay'ani. Shay'ani takhadaha. When two sukun, when two alphabets, which end with sukun, sound mati, the first man becomes alive. It's not a noon. It's just sound. Shay'ani takhadaha. Shay'ani takhadaha. Arabic cannot start with a sukun. Remember this? No Arabic word, the Arabic language, no word starts with sukun. Mati. And when two sukun sound come together, the first one becomes, becomes um, mobile. That's why the only living language is Arabic. Living and alive. You have to think. Before you read, you think. Unlike any language. Any language, you just read. Arabic, no, you think. How to pronounce it. That's why people who study Arabic or read Quran, they don't suffer from Alzheimer. Subhanallah. You know that or not? Just read Arabic so that at least when you get old, you don't forget. We keep telling people, read Quran. At least when I become old, I don't forget. You may forget English. You may forget, subhanAllah, Malay, uh, but not the Quran. MashaAllah. Continue. Ula'ika lahum azabun muheen. أولئك لهم عذاب مهين Why do we have mad there? Because of Why we have elongation? أولئك Very good Because Hamza Hamza is coming The rule Now you know Or Sabdu من وراء إِهِمْ جَهَنَّمُ What do we say in your heart? What do we say? نعوذ بالله When you hear جَهَنَّم نراك نار You say نعوذ بالله In your heart مِنْ وَرَائِهِمْ جَهَنَّم Now you say in your heart نعوذ بالله Even when you read even when you're praying taraweeh or uh, leading people or by yourself. That's why Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa many sahaba ask him, why you pause, O Messenger of Allah? He said, I, use, I was asking Allah to protect me and you from Jahannam. Jannah, he used to ask Allah. For example, أُولَٰئِكَ هُمُ الْوَارِثُونَ الَّذِينَ يَرِثُونَ الْفِرْدَوْسِ هُمْ فِيهَا خَالِدُونَ At Firdaus he says, Allahumma adkhidna al-fidas. So he, he, he poses. Today if you do that, people think you forgot, they, they may correct you. Yeah, okay, wait. Thank you. <laughs> okay. وَلَا يُغْنِي عَنْهُمْ مَا كَسَبُوا شَيْئًا وَلَا 
ولا ما اتخذوا من دون الله أولياء نو 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 ولا ما اتخذوا ما اتخذوا ولا ما اتخذوا ما اتخذوا نوت ما اتخذوا ولا ما اتخذوا من دون الله أولياء ولهم عذاب عظيم هذا هدى والذين كفروا بآيات ربهم لهم عذاب من رجز أليم الله الذي سخر لكم البحر لتجري الفلك فيه بأمره ولتبتغوا من فضله ولعلكم تشكرون وسخر لكم ما في السماوات وما في الأرض جميعا منه إن في ذلك لآيات لقوم يتفكرون Excellent. Very good. We'll see what is al-jathiyah next time, inshallah. We go now back to verse 33, <coughs> where we stopped last week. We said that Fir'aun, na'udhu billah, Fir'aun, Ramses II, was among the Musrifin, or Amber Israf, or Amber Mumbazir. He was Mumbazir. But not in, only in material things. He was not Mumbazir only in material things, which is, na'udhu billah, one of the major sins. Do you know that? Do you know, brothers, if you don't need something and you have it extra, you are considered Mumbazir? For example, you have more than two, three pairs of shoes. We are all guilty of this. Why you have more? Why? Oh, no, Sheikh. Uh, you see, lifestyle. Your lifestyle is messed up. You need to change your life before you go to the grave and be questioned for something you didn't even use. Wake up, wake up, brothers and sisters. If we read the Quran and Hadith and don't change, then what good, what good? We study, we attend classes, we don't change. Ah, this is better drink, alhamdulillah. Mint. Takbir. Sabar, I was just sabar. I was just sabar. Takbir. No, serious, brothers and sisters. Why did you go to school when you were little? For fun? Or to have a better life so that when you grow up, when you graduate, you be, you'll have a better job. So when we come to seek knowledge like this, you have to change. If you don't change, then there is a problem with you. Fir'aun was not just Mumbazir in the material world. He was, he was Mumbazir in sins. Meaning, he was so much into sins. He was a sinner. And he used to order his people to sin. Who can give me some of the examples they sinned, Fir'aun is sinned with? Huh? Very good, yes? Yes? What did he do? Very good. He killed babies. Look, killing even an adult is haram. You kill an adult who is innocent. It's haram. How about killing an, 
a baby. It's not even a six years old or 10 years old, a baby. What did that baby do? What was his crime? What else? So he ordered the killing of babies. What else? Shirk, shirk. The biggest thing is shirk. He, he worshiped idols. Then he said, worship me, and I am your highest God. That's where we stopped. Look at it. Verse 31. إِنَّهُ كَانَ عَالِيًا مِنَ الْمُسْرِفِينَ Fir'aun was what? Was very arrogant and he was among the musrifun, the people who do transgress all bounds and many times, not just one time, you know, people make sins. No, he insisted on sins. Then we saw the second ayah, وَلَقَدْ اِخْتَرْنَاهُمْ عَلَىٰ عِلْمٍ عَلَىٰ الْعَالَمِينَ Meaning, Bani Israel, we have chosen them over mankind at that moment because they have to follow Musa السلام, please understand you may find an ayah or two in the Quran like this one that says that Bani Israel have been chosen and then you say Sheikh well, well you see Bani Israel are chosen Ya Akhi read the ayah in its context <coughs> whose prophet was sent to them and when did Allah say they are when when did he say with, with, when they ran away from Fir'aun and followed Musa that is the context. Don't take that ayah out of context and spread it worldwide because that's exactly what the Jews want. Many Israel, the, the Zionists and the Freemasons, they want you to believe that Jews are better race than you. That's why now the so-called Israel is distorted because the white Ashkenazi Jews are very racist even against their Ethiopian black Jews. You know that or not? Big problem in so-called Israel. But nobody talks. Because so-called Israel is in danger from inside. Subhanallah. They messed up many Muslim countries. Allah is messing them from the inside. What goes around? Comes around. Black Jews. Ethiopian Jews. Yeah. The Ethiopian Jews are called the Falasha. I need to give you a lecture about the Jews. Malays know nothing but Jews. Takbir. No serious. That's why you cannot. You know nothing about the Jews. Be careful. They are here. They are in Singapore. The way Singapore runs itself as a government is very Mossadic. A very Mossadic. So, you are in danger. Anyways. Uh, Yahud, the, the blacks, the black Jews are called Falasha. Al Falasha, remember this. The white Jews, European with blue eyes, are called Ashkenazis. They come from Western Europe. And then there is Eastern Jews of East, East Europe, especially Russia. Then there is Sephardim, those who were in uh, Spain, Muslim Spain, and then they were hunted by the Christians and run away with the Muslims. And it's the Muslims who give them shelter. Then they betray the Muslims and they are, they are the people who work with the French to occupy Algeria. And you need to know this history. So the Sephardim are the Jews of what is today called North Africa. Little in, still remaining in uh, Algeria. Uh, Tunis, Morocco a lot. Most of the generals of the Israeli army are Moroccan, Moroccan uh, generals. <coughs> Who is their enemy? The Arabs. So they have to have an Arab spoken Jew. They know what, who to put, you think? So, so far how many types of Jews I gave you? Four. Remember them, Ashkenazis, like uh, Netanyahu, Bibi Netanyahu, okay? Speaks good English, speaks almost perfect English. You don't know them, they are British, they are French, they are uh, Polish, they are uh, this one, Italians, they are Spanish, Europe, Europe, they come from there. America and this and that. Then there is the Falasha. And these are the people who are like the laborers, they work very hard. Yet, they look at them like second class citizens. They look at their own as second class. Do you think they will look at you as a... Wake up, wake up. 
And you know what the Falasha were calling? Just three, four, four days ago. They were saying, Allahu Akbar, where is Hamas? <laughs> Palestine. <laughs> because now they're hurt. Why? Find out. Uh, the Falasha. <laughs> then we said Safardim. The Jews, Safardim of North Africa. But their origin is Spain. They came from Spain during the uh, Crusades of uh, Inquisitions when the, uh, what's her name? Uh, the Queen of Spain. During Isabella. Isabella and her husband started persecuting anyone who is not Christian. Subhanallah, who helped the Jews? The Muslims. No one helped the Jews more than the Muslims in history. Yet they always turn against us because we don't learn from history. Then we have the Ashkenazis. Also be careful, there are many Jews in Kashmir and India. There are many Jews. Careful. Especially Kashmir area. Now, not every Kashmiri is a Jew. There are many Jews there. So when you go there, don't think you went to paradise. In paradise, you should deal with people without any worry. In Mecca still, ah, there are also Jews of Arabs. What, where do you think Bani Quraida went? The, the, Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, when he kicked out the Jews from Medina, where do you think they went? They dispersed in the land, and many, many women, he spared the women because men betrayed. They went where? They got married with some Arabs, and now they are ruling, most of them, the Muslim Arab world. Just look at their actions, and you see. Okay, continue. وَآتَيْنَاهُمْ مِنَ الْآيَاتِ مَا فِيهِ بَلَاءٌ مُبِينٌ we stopped at the brothers, so brother Lat, go ahead. Last week we stopped at you, right? After you. You, you were the last to read. Okay, today you are the first to read. Yes. Indeed, these believers are saying. Continue. No. Not 34, 33, 34. وَآتَيْنَاهُمْ And we gave them of signs that in which there was a clear trial. Very good. Continue. Indeed, these disbelievers are saying. Very good. وَآتَيْنَاهُمْ مِنَ الْآيَاتِ مَا فِيهِ بَلَاءٌ مُبِينٌ We gave Fir'aun all kind of signs. <laughs> but he refused. Clear signs. Brother, somebody put a huge red light in front of you and he's saying red and you pass the line and you get accident. Who to blame? <coughs> you ignored it. It was there in front of you. The problem is not, so, oh, it was too high. That's why I didn't see it. It was there in front of you. Your mind was somewhere else. Inna haula ila yaqulun. What do they say? What do they say? The people of Fir'aun, they say something, big mistake. And your people, O Muhammad, are repeating the same thing. Because now Allah is talking to the Prophet ﷺ. Your people, O Muhammad, are making the same mistake of Fir'aun and his people. What was that mistake, Brother Raja? There is nothing but our first death, and we shall not be uh, What was the biggest challenge Prophet Muhammad ﷺ faced? In Mecca. There was a big thing he... It was really, really big for him. What was it? The shirk? No. Believing in Allah? No. What was it? Riba? Zina? No. They did not believe in life after death. His people said there is no life after death. You may convince them that, look, this is just an idol. It's not God. I can throw it. Look, I break it. Nothing happened to me. Maybe he said, okay. But tell him there is no life after death. He says, no. Meaning they were stubborn. <coughs> Fir'aun was like that. That's why. Why do you think they have those tombs? 
and gold and silver buried with them because they believe there is no the Egyptians didn't believe the old Egyptians didn't believe in life after death that's why they mummify why we bury why we the Muslims bury because we believe in life after death why the Christians bury why the Jews bury why the Hindus burn because they believe in re reincarnation that's why they take the ashes to the Ganges River they say they have certain beliefs so subhanallah you act in this dunya according to your beliefs that's why it's utmost important to to fix your beliefs some people think it's just a bit, no your suluk your actions will follow exactly how you believe whatever you believe your action uh, look why most criminals don't repent in the christian uh, tradition christians why they don't repent yes and then i'm asking you a question and you are as if Adhan is going to run away Allahu akbar MashaAllah, only in this masjid you are so respectful too. Love. Yeah. 